The first DFW campaign is completed. Finally. Now, now that it's completed, it is time to move on to the two others that I purchased with my money. Now, I am curious As to see Sean what this Hammond is. Hammond realized his vision for Jurassic Park, mm -hmm. his competitors began to see the potential of InGen's work. Really? One of their main rivals, Biosyn, looked to close the gap by stealing the advantages that InGen and Dr. Wu had worked so hard to gain. Mm -hmm. To do this, they would need someone on the inside. So they enlisted a disgruntled computer engineer named Dennis Nedry. Dennis? A plan was devised to steal InGen's dinosaur embryos with an inconspicuous canister created to house the precious commodity. Nobody really knows what happened that fateful night. What is certain is that Dennis Nedry and the samples were never seen again. Biosyn had failed. Unfortunately, so too had Hammond's dream. Decades later, businessman Simon Mizrani tried again. This time, succeeding in delivering Hammond's vision to the world. Tragically, things didn't go as planned. Biosyn was waiting for its time, and they found it in the aftermath of Jurassic World's downfall. Now, led by Lewis Dodgson, a new era was dawning. While we don't know what the future holds, history has a habit of repeating itself. Hmm. You know, it could be the fact that these, uh companies are managing the dinosaurs rather than a formal organization it could be that just saying just look at it biosyn genetics research we are so close to realizing biosyn's dream one that in gen man quit your yapping what should we doing yeah okay okay uh -huh. this looks cool i guess what they say is true it's location 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 more than you realize this is perfect. Keeps us away from the public's prying eyes and keeps the political do-gooders at arm's length. To think what InGen had and fumbled away. They never saw the bigger picture. All dinosaur and zero business. That is where Biosyn wins. We bring a balance that InGen never understood. We see the whole picture. Okay, what's our next step? I don't want to waste any time getting this going. Hmm. What is this, it all though? Starts with the control center. Remember, it needs to be connected to the Hyperloop network. What? Right, then. Get started. What even is that? Oh, there's a control center. Where do I place this? Oh. Where does it go? Oh, I see. Okay, here's the border. This is just some thing. I don't know what this is. Oh, let's go ahead and place this control center. What in the world? Oh, it's like a... That makes sense. It, it's underground. It's a path underground. Well, that's strange. Can I connect it? Yeah, I can. Very well. I'll do that. Um. But wait, it's connected, right? I, I think it is. Can you do this in the actual game, or is this only for the campaign? Because I've never seen this before. What is a hyperloop? Sounds kind of freaky. View research. Hmm, yes, here's the research. Oh, here are all the new dinosaur wars. These four right here. Oops. These ones. We got a... Pyroraptor... Dread no guntas. Um, Theorizinosaurus. And a Giganotosaurus. Noto? Or is that Nata? Nato? I think it's Noto. Giganoto. I could be wrong though. Hurry up and build quicker. I want to see these things. Everything's in place for us to get our new research compound constructed. So you don't say. Then we can focus on getting it operational. Operational. Do I have to connect this one too? 
I would assume so. Oh, yes. Um, which is a bit strange. Oh, there we go. Isaac, update. Huh. Everything is going to plan. We should have the research we need shortly. Great. Very interesting. Let me go ahead and connect the paths real quick. Well, this one's definitely going to be very different than the DFW. I mean, it already feels a little foreign. But I'm sure it's going to be good. Uh, hopefully. Because I paid money for this. Nah, it'll be good. I got some cool dinosaurs to go with it too, so that all works out. There we go. Now, stage one, core facilities. Ready to research? Go to research. Ah, yes. Such great instructions. Um, where do I go? That's odd. Wait. I don't understand. Advance the construction of research co compound? Um, ooh, these buildings look nice. I'm pretty sure we get access to these buildings, too. I would only hope so. And this hatchery is very nice. Yeah, not bad. Not bad, I suppose. Let's see, research outpost, emergency shelter, that looks quite nice. So, research the following. Stage one, core facilities. Ah, yes, of course. Right here, is that correct? Let's see, core facilities. We're gonna be fit right here. There we go. Kong. Hmm. There. Did I do it? Oh. It says pause. Do I have to... I don't know why the game pauses when in there, but okay. And it's finished. Good, good, good. All right. Okay, that did it. We have mm -hmm. access to the core facilities research. Great. Our vision is coming together of each building we get operational. We just need to ensure we can handle all the dinosaurs when they arrive. I think we can do that. It's all starting to come together, just as we envisioned. We are leaving InGen in our dust. Well, I will give them some credit. They did resurrect the dinosaurs from extinction. Sure, through a rushed agenda and lazy science. We're doing it right. Their failures were our education. We won't be making the same mistakes Hammond and his team made. InGen always fell in love with their own wonder. They wanted to prove to the world that they could do it. Once they did, they wanted to showcase them as circus freaks and rub our faces in it. They didn't get it. Evolution is not just DNA and frogs. It also happens in business to advance the world. Think of what we will bring to the world. Think of what we will bring to humanity. New medicines, biotechnology, beauty products, you name it, we will own it. Um... Yeah, that guy definitely yeah. Functioning facility. That is the only way we can secure the dinosaur survival. Absolutely, we'll get it done. See that you do. A lot is riding on it. Yes, average bourgeois thinking. Simply owning things for business will advance humanity. Such a foolish way of thought. Unfortunately, there is. Is this path okay? I'm not even moving it. I'm just zooming in and out. What in the world? Freaky shit. Unfortunately, there is people that actually think like that. A lot of people. But one day, the bourgeois will have all the wealth in the world to the point where people will no longer care and want to change. You see, it is all part of my 2049 process. Now, these things move really f weirdly. Payload medical facility in an emergency shelter. Very well. I've always liked these little hospital things. They look nice. Very nice indeed. Let me expand the path here. No, I want... I really wanted to get back to playing Generation Zero, but... 
it did get really repetitive. I wish it didn't. It was really fun. But it did get repetitive. I wish it was maybe more of a zombie game rather than a robot one, but I have no complaints. It, is, it was still good. I might download it back just for the fun of it. Very good game indeed. Of course, to start over, um, I do have some, a good amount of experience with it. Good amount indeed. Yes, yes, lots of experience. I'll probably definitely will. The atmosphere of Generation Zero is uh, it's, it's extremely unique. I mean, I think most of those apocalypse types of games are really nice. Always, in my opinion. But that one, completely different context. Oh, yes. Very different. Now, here's all that's left. There we go. Everything is complete. We authorized to expand our team, specifically scientists. At 12 million. The candidates and let's add some to our operation. Of course. Now, of course, I'm going to go for the expensive ones. I refuse to buy fools. Uh, not buy, um, hire. Not, not buy. Yeah, I, I had like 13 million dollars. I can definitely get the expensive ones here. No reasons to get to the non-expensive ones. No reason indeed. I think Kong is good, yes? That should be good enough. What is next? Welfare. Recruit additional scientists and increases. Total skill to logistics, genetics, welfare. I have two more. I guess I'll have to fire Kong. Um, no. I just, I need more welfare. The, Kong has the most welfare here. Yes, isn't that what the little plus is? That's a little silly. That is a bit silly. Recruit additional scientists, increasing total skill to logistics, genetics, welfare. One more required. Why would you give, why would you allow me to hire scientists that don't meet the requirements? That's very silly, but okay. So three, one, and one. Um, but if I fire one of these, I'm going to need, I'm still going to have to require something else, right? Is this, is this some type of puzzle? Oh, please. That can't be. Increase scientists hiring capacity. Okay. I was about to say. I <laughs> I got a little worried there. I was about to like, mmm, that's uh that doesn't really make any sense. Okay, good thing good thing I didn't follow through with that from what I thought it was. I just need to build this and then There we go. Now I can hire more fools. Yes. Okay. One's preferably with welfare, of course. I have exciting news. Do We're you? Closing in on some exclusive biosyn tech. Invisible fencing. It'll secure. Whoa, 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 whoa. Did I hear that right? Did this man just say invisible fencing? The animals, while removing the traditional man made constructs that have surrounded their environments. So, no visible barrier between us and the dinosaurs? That sounds terrifying. Uh, 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 the more these animals believe they are not in cages, the healthier they will be. Yeah, that will make them easier to care for. I think we'd better place some research outposts as well. We can observe our animals safely from there. You know, it's bad enough that dinosaurs never knew what a fence was until we placed them around them. But what if they become dependent on them to feel safe? At least they could see a barrier between us and them. How are they even going to trust their environment with invisible fences? How are they even going to know where they are? Oh, believe me, they'll feel it if they try to cross one. Yeah, that. I don't know. 
Look, it feels like we're messing with them and how comfortable they'll be in their environment. You're concerned about fences? The dinosaurs never saw a human before either, and that hasn't stopped us. You know, I'm getting a little concerned with these dinosaur sympathizers, but uh, I suppose I understand their perspective in a way. Though, it is quite foolish, if I must. I must place this electricity thingy so this thing has power to operate. Um, I don't think I placed down the right thing. No, I did not. Hold on. What? <laughs> oh, I'm a little. I'm a little lost here. Did I? What did I place down? What was that? Let me do that, please. There we go. Connect those. Is this? Is this what I need right here? To. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That is okay. I got a little confused there. Just a bit. Just a bit. There we go. Yes. Now it has power. Good. Now, where was I? Mm, oh, yes. Advance the construction of the research compound. Research the following. Stage two. Welfare. Ah, uh, yes, of course. The welfare. Do not forget the welfare. Stage two. Um, how many fools do I need to go in here? Oh, I can only assign two. Oh, okay. Now let me assign the best, then. There we go. And that should be done in a GIF. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three... Two, one, zero point five, zero point four, zero point three, zero point two, zero point one, and zero. Nice. And this thing is upgrading while it's at it, which is also interesting. Isaac, we've got an issue. We're in need of Already? Power. How close are we to maximum output? Already there. We won't be able to hold much longer. Then we'll need to research how to get more. Upgraded power stations is the way forward. Let's get to it. Very well. More power. More power. Need more power. There we go. Ooh, researching very fast. In three, two, one. Yes, there it is. Um, what do I do now? Apply the increased output upgrade to the hydro power hub. Where do I access this? Oh, I am a fool. What am I doing? Increased output. There we go. Before we go any further, there's something I want from you. Mm -hmm. Through my connections, I've arranged for a number of dinosaurs to be delivered here to our facility. Mm -hmm. They're coming all the way from Isla Sorna, so you'll have some time to prepare for their arrival. I'm confident you won't let me down. They're going to need enclosures, secure enclosures. Safety really? is essential for them and us. You don't we say. have to get this right. We don't need another InGen or Masrani incident. Absolutely. We will do better. You don't say. You know, I wonder what the new movie's gonna be about, especially after they said they're ending the series, which was with this one. If I'm correct. Oh, when is it coming out? Is it 2025? I forgot. Honestly, I forgot. Fences! Ah! Oh. Separates dinosaurs from operators and each other. Defense's security rating determines how easy it is for the dinosaur to escape. Oh, I did not know that. Invisible gate and fences. Um, well, it's... Well, that's interesting. 
Now I wonder how that works. I wonder how that works indeed. Curious. Well, let's see how it works then. I'm going to place this one here. I'm going to curve it. There we go. Oh. Stegosaurus? What the heck? <laughs> I forgot I forgot they were coming. Um yes, I, I I should should be able to finish this very soon. Just need a bit more time. Almost finished. There. Um yes, it's interesting. Uh Whoa. I don't know. It's just it, it's gonna feel weird. Like it's it's gonna feel weird. Arrival of Stegosaurus, arrival of Galliminus. I forgot. Uh, I know what those ones are. I just cannot pronounce it. Galliminus, Mimos, Parasol. Oh man, I know what that one is too. Parasolophysis, Solophysis, Sorophilus. Parasolophysis. Mm. Yes, this is why I always just refer to them as Stego, Galli, and Para. Mm, yes. The names of the dinosaurs. Something that is almost near impossible for me to pronounce. Now, I think what something would be very amusing is to try and hear Nuggies pronounce these. Now, it would make me harder to pronounce them once I hear Nuggies try to pronounce them, but I already can't really pronounce them, so it doesn't, doesn't matter, honestly. Uh, give me two minutes. How does this work? Oh, that, that's really weird. Oh, yes, that's, uh... I mean, <laughs> that... It's... It's strange. Rather, very strange. Let me speed these up, though. I'm going to put these ones in here. Oh, the Stegosaurus. Um, I was thinking of putting the galleys in here. Hmm. Let me make more. Need to make more. Is it curving? Give me a moment. That's a lot, too. Six? Jesus. Now, I hope these are big enough. Um, if they aren't, then it will. I'll make them. Oh, come on. You can't be serious. Okay, I, I need. Uh, I was going to put these in here, anyways. There we go. Put those fools in there. No, fool. Wait. Let me finish this first. This one could be for the Stegosaurus, I suppose. I'm not sure. Now, my question is, how big do I have to make this so they don't get, like... Oh, it's too small. It, it's so small, I'm, I'm gonna break out. Uh, I don't know how they're gonna break out of these, like, there's literally nothing there. I mean, I wonder what it is exactly, but... I'm not sure. Really, I'm not. Let's go ahead and put these rats in here, though. Is it big enough? Is it big enough? Especially with the population. Is it big enough? Uh, I have a response facility, yes. I need to... Because I can't... I have to, like... Oh, apparently it already shows me. Why? That's a lot nicer, to be honest. Okay, forest. There's your forest fools. Oh, ground leaf. They, they need ground leaf. My, my apologies. There. I'm gonna try to like even it out a little bit. 
There we go. And then of course water. Wait. Let me give these fools water. Is that good? How's that? I don't know how that's not enough water. Maybe see, maybe I do need to make it bigger then. And it shouldn't be an issue. It's a hundred percent perfect. No need. As long as it's a hundred percent perfect. These things look quite nice. Not bad. And it, it's it's so it's weird because it because <laughs> it looks like it, but it's. Oh yeah, that, that's weird. Okay, that's cool though. Interesting fences. I wonder how they break out though. That's my question, but uh, whatever, it's fine. Okay, so let's go ahead and get these things out of stuff. So first, water. There's your water, you rats. And you also need forest. Anything specific? No, no specific forest. Ground nut. Aha, I almost made the same mistake. Not today. Here it is. There we go. Oh, these are nice horses. Uh, horses! Trees! <laughs> Dinosaurs! I said horses! What am I... What am I saying? Missing open space. Okay, so see, they do need more open space. Very well then. I shall... Very kindly... Enlarge. Um, you know, I'm gonna do that thing what I usually do. I can't really see because of the whole this, this yellow thing. I, I can't see. Can I? Thank you. Okay, that's that's so much better. I thought that was gonna be like. I thought there was no way to turn that off. I was. I was gonna get a little concerned. Just a bit. Just a bit. Now, how would I do this? I suppose I could do just straight thing I do, which is essentially just doing this right here. Something like, there we go. And then once they form territories over here, that's more space for them. Dinosaur threat? How are they a danger to guess? Do they like just run out or something? Are, are they gonna form the rest of their territory? Cause I gave them more space uh, and they're not, what in the world? Scared me. Um, okay. Yeah, because I gave them more space they just need to form their territory. So please form it over there, man. That's where I'm going to clap these things eventually. There, see? More space. This is more space. I'm even going to add more right here. Because I'm just such a generous guy, you see. See? Look at all that beautiful space. That's right, expand your territory, you rats. Now let's see, more forest? Oh my goodness, how much forest do you, wait, does this not give them forest? Oh no, it doesn't. Okay. Wait, see, I can't even attend to the stegosaurus here. These rats are in the way. Mm. There. Is that not enough? I suppose I would need to make it bigger. They just need to come over here. And everything should be fine. Almost perfect. Almost perfect. Almost there. 99. 100. See? It all works out and then. Though, how are they a danger? Oh, never mind. Oh, right. The Sega's horses. I cannot forget these ones. Not the stegosauruses. No. They can't be. Hmm. 
Once I'm finally done with these silly dinosaur ga oh, you gotta be kidding me. Silly dinosaur game, I will decide on what I shall do next. I'm really considering ground, no, sorry, Generation Zero. It was just such a great game of atmosphere. Mm. It reminds me of a game I did want to get, but I decided not to. It was Day Z. Now, the reason what stopped me from getting it is because it really just felt like another silly version of Ark Survival, where it's like the game's great, but it's the decisions made by the developers or the people that own the game, obviously. Uh, like, you buy the game for $50, but you can't make, you can't like, you have to pay the subscription or you have to pay more to play the game in a private server or, you know, whatever there is, which is just so silly sometimes, at least in my opinion, because you're, you're paying for the game and you're, you're not, you can't even get like the full experience necessarily. Uh, it looks like the enclosures are ready. We need to yes. make these habitats as desirable for the dinosaurs as we can. Mm-hmm. Of course, of course. <coughs> That's what I plan to do. Ramsey, I've been going through the data, and I think we can make some real progress if we get a research outpost connected to our hyperloop. Yeah, makes sense to me. Awesome. Then let's make it happen. Hmm. Without proper security, we slip into the same chaos that brought down our rivals. But our ranger team should be capable of maintaining order. We'll set up the necessary patrols. Yeah, I don't have to remind you. Remote monitoring can only go so far. Of course. We'll get right on it. Give me one moment, let me finish these fences. These silly fences. Ugh, how dare you connect to that thing? State no silly fence. This fence refuses to listen to my commands. Uh Stegosaurus's enclosure is gonna be quite big. But uh I think these ones are more what's the term? Needy, I suppose. I'm just giving them the space they need. See? Ah, uh, yes. Such beautiful borders is what I'm looking at right now. <laughs> Alright, now, before I... Let me finish the path. Get through it right here. Always works out in the end. There we go. Now, what was that? Oh, yes. These silly things. Ground fiber. Very well. Type of ground fiber. And ground fruit. Hmm. You need a lot. Seems like. Is seven percent water is enough for them apparently? Okay, that's interesting. Uh forest. Um and ground fruit. Where's the ground fruit? This has ground fruit in it. Hmm. Nice. See? It all works out in there. Now, apparently that's enough water for them. Just this, this little piece right here. Shared. Like, this right here. Well, if that's enough water for them, I see no reason to give them anymore but i will just in case i add more because i think the higher the population they, the more they need if i'm correct i i don't know for sure there that is okay now where is it right here research outpost this is gonna make the money let's go ahead and connect that and oh i don't think i need to have any path it connect. Okay, that's cool. I, I like that a lot. Yes, I don't think I need a path. This is good then. Is everything going fine here? 
Missing forest? Fool. Do you not have enough forest? They need more forest, apparently. Oh, they haven't even expanded the territories over here. Okay, I shall give them this then. More forest it is then. No power. Oh yes, I need to add the power to the... Just forgot about that. There we go. You got to be kidding me. Move, fool. Move. That is not too close. What do you mean? Do I have to wait? I can place it right here. But I can't place it right here. No! Oh my goodness. <laughs> this game is dumb. Please. Oh my goodness. City skylines. How could this be? Hmm. Whatever. I don't care. There. More space. Is it good now? Now is it good? Should be good enough. I hope. Oh, I can't forget this, too. Let me add that. Seriously. That is so in the way. Can't see anything. Did I already have one? No, I did not. Okay, so the gates are right there. All right, that's, that's perfect. Now, what exactly has no power? This? Nothing. Well, something said it had no power. Oh, whatever. I want to make sure the whole place is viewable. Oh, can I go through? I cannot. I have to go right over here. Oh, last. I must take curve. That makes sense. It has to. There we go. That one's connected. Now, is there any more? Right here. Oh, I can, I can I have it inside? I can. Well, that's cool. Not bad. It, it, lo it looks all... It looks... It, it'll do. It's, it's good. It looks good so far. And I'm going to clear some of these trees that are not in the cages so, so I can kind of visualize what's going on here exactly. Not to destroy their... their trees. Should be fine. Yeah, there we go. There we go. See? Now I can see a little bit better. And the sun just came out. Nice. Now, make sure all dinosaurs can be reached by a ranger post. Oh, yes. I almost forgot about these. The ranger posts. Um. One right here. One right here. And one right there. Now, do we're... Where's my response facility? Right here. Can I assign to multiple? I cannot. Do I have to have... No, I don't. I don't right now. Of course not. Must I? Do I? Huh. Ever heard the phrase you are victims of your own success because gentlemen that's where you find yourselves actually yes you are going to be a victim of your own success you see your success of uh, successfully exploiting the workers and the proletariat will get you beheaded by the year 2050 yes yes you are much very much a victim of your success you are correct yeah i 100 percent agree with uh that saying mm -hmm. yes I'm not sure i follow means we're doing our job so we can take on even more whatever mm -hmm. the challenge we're ready then welcome okay. to the biosyn genetics research compound phase three this will allow us to continue expanding our genetic engineering division and take our operations to the next level oh really biosyn is counting on you more importantly i am counting on you we need perfect genetic samples for the best outcome that is something biosyn will write a check for yeah, 
But we're not yet in control. We're dependent on others until we get in a position to send out our own expeditions. And I don't like being unable to control the outcome of something. Yes, but once this research is done, we'll be able to set... These fools are yapping again. Now, if I may, Nuggies is ca just cannot be doing this right now. The fool. I make no mistake. In our own expeditions. We should be in a better place around our samples. If we own and control it, it's better for Biosyn. And you. Hmm. Yes, I can never really truly understand what they're yapping about. Anyways, let's go ahead and research whatever uh, this bullshit is right here. Um, wait, how much can I do? Up to four. Oh, you don't say. Get them all in there, then. Get them all in there. Now, when I started this, I had a little less than 13 million. And it is going up gladly. Every... Every few seconds, I'm getting hundreds of thousands of dollars just to improve everything here. <laughs> yes. Okay, you're ready to build an expedition center. Oh, get on set. We'll need a fossil center too. Understood. These buildings will put biosyn at the cutting edge of bioengineering. Oh, really? You don't say. Is that so? Let's see if this fool speaks facts or not. Why is there water right there? This little puddle's in the way of my building. I despise you, puddle. I despise that puddle. Now. Oh, yes, here we go. So, expedition. Hmm. Another one of these. Wait, do I have to? Oh, no, I don't have to. Well, more is always better. More is indeed always better. As long as I have the money for it. Now, where's the path? Oh, there it is. There we go. Not bad, I suppose. Now, oh yes, these things need power. I can't forget that. I almost always forget the power. Every time. The power. I always forget the power. Uh, Hydro Power Hub. My understanding is that we're ready to send out a team? Oh. That's correct. Good. I want you to start with an amber mining expedition. Amber? This valley wasn't chosen by accident. This area is rich with amber. And I intend for Biosyn to exploit that. Insects trapped in prehistoric tree sap. Mm. That is what we need. This is where our dinosaurs begin. This amber is going to be the time capsule that links us back to the era of the dinosaurs. It's a window to the past. And worth billions. Ramsey, have our scientists extract what they can from the fossils. That'll increase our genome diversity. Yes, on it. Hmm. And what is the end goal of this? To do the impossible again. The impossible. Mm. Yes. You see, the bourgeois here are so bored because they have so much money that they must do, in quote, the impossible. Ah, yes. What a perfect society we live in, indeed. I wonder if it may change one day. Maybe. Maybe not. Who knows, I suppose. Who knows. Increase genome. That's about to increase in the next one, two, three, four, five seconds now. Hmm. Interesting. Ooh. Oh, yes, I remember doing this in number one. Okay, so. Oh, wow. That's very different, though. 
Oh, okay, so this is small, this is large, and this is medium, I'm assuming. That's cool. Now get the fool. Do those quickly. Wow, you won't sped up the edge, it takes a long time. My goodness. Well, well that wait for that. Can I turn the path over here? No, I cannot. Mm. Oh yes. I should probably be making more invisible fences for the possible potential dinosaurs that will be coming over here. I think that's the most logical thing to be doing while I wait. Oh yes, this will definitely pass the time. It's more than halfway already. And I wish this circle could be a bit bigger. I want to clear these trees a lot more efficiently, but this is what I can do for now. Though I must say, 1.1 million, I mean, oh man, that's just going up. You know, how high could that get? I kind of want to see. Oh my goodness. See my money, money plunder. Two million. Look at the bottom where the money. Three point, oh my goodness, three million. It's going down. Ah, yes. This is going to be the bourgeois bank accounts once we seize their wealth. <laughs> it will be quite the sight, I must say. All the way down to 3.33 million. Hmm, yes. Very nice. Now, where was I? Um, oh, yes. I cannot forget. Wait, shouldn't I keep... I can, should continue to send more out there. Uh, let's see. What should we do? I, I, want, I want carnosauruses, you know. I think they're just... They're just cooler. They're just so much cooler. 60%, that's 13 more percent. Oh, okay, I understand now. A uh, little... Thing, though. Is there any more... Carnosauruses around here? What is this? I want this. Hmm. Okay, that's gonna take some time. Increase day. Oh, it, it's telling me what specific dinosaur to increase. Oh, okay. I, I should have done that then. I was wondering, why is it not doing it? Why is it not to being completed? Because I'm doing the wrong one. I'm a fool. Ooh. Oh, it's this thing. Wait, is that the one I need to do? Dimetrodon? Dimetrodon? Or is it Dimetrodon? Hmm. Yes, English. Such an advanced language, yeah. Barry. Oh yeah, it is this one. Very well then. Oh, I have to wait for that to finish. It's one more minute. Very well. I should start making some cages. Some cages. There we go. Let's go ahead and connect these fools. These fools. Yes. I can't get Jeezy off my mind now. It's just, uh, it's just there, I suppose. Such a great game. Such a great game indeed. Uh, I can't do these fences. You know, these fences can be a pain in the ass sometimes. I think the building in general can. But, no issue. Always get around it. Oh yes, very, very much around it. There we go. Hmm. That should be big enough for whatever I'm gonna stuff into here. Hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Oh yes, did it finish? Show me. Oh yes. There we go. Three? No. Oh, that's one. Oh. There we go. Get to work. I need these Trodon things. Damachodons. Whatever you want to call them. They look kind of freaky. Literally giant lizards. No doubt. You know what? I see no issue to just connect these. Honestly. I'm actually going to start. I should, yeah, definitely got to start doing that. Should be connecting them. No reason to not be connecting them. Another game I would also like to play is Battlefield 2042. Now, it did start off really horribly. Um, 
but it's still a really good game. I mean, it's a lot of fun. My, my problem with it is that my PS5 cannot handle it. it it's the one game my PS5 can't handle. That cat for my PS5 is, unfortunately, it's practically, practically killed my PS5. That's it. We That's got a it. breakthrough. A breakthrough. An entirely new genome. Oh my so what goodness. What you're saying is we've discovered a new dinosaur, one we've never seen before. Sort of. It is sort incredible, of. but it's not actually a dinosaur per se. Really? It's a prehistoric synapse called Dimetrodon. Huh. Dimetrodon. Uh, Did I was right. Did have one of these? I don't believe so. Perfect. A biosyn exclusive. This DNA is only part of the puzzle, though. We still need to build a hatchery and then synthesize this new breed. Once we've done that, we can incubate and release them. I can't wait. You're the fool. You can't wait. Ah, uh, yes. Connecting them like this is a, it's a superior way of building. You know, it reminds me of uh, geopolitical borders of countries and nations around our world, known as the planet Earth. You see, these borders, artificial borders, as is exactly what they are, shall be eliminated by, mm, hopefully, when will the Earth be united? Let's say, let's say global proletarian revolutions happen by 2060. Assuming by 21,000, all borders will be open. And hopefully by the year... 2150? Uh, unfortunately, I won't be here to, to see it myself. But if, if it exists, I shall be watching from above. We all will. And waiting patiently for the Earth to be united. That's if, of course, we don't blow ourselves up. If we do... If the bourgeois decide that we all explode due to their selfishness, then, well, I suppose well, that will be the end of our species, unfortunately. I mean, it will be. No getting around that, that's for sure. Not possible. But... I have great hope that that won't happen. Very much great hope. And I would really hope to see helicopters without these propellers in the future. Just imagine floating things. I mean, this helicopter really looks nice. Ah, I love helicopters. They remind me of bees or wasps. But engineered, created, manufactured, and controlled by us humans. That's what they remind me of. And of course, uh, uh, much bigger. Much, much bigger. Very large indeed. Hmm. I wonder what g these types of games will be like in the future as well. VR is advancing very, very quickly. It's going to become something that will not be comprehensible. No, not at all. Speaking of these dinosaurs, I wonder if we will be able to bring these back. Huh. It may be possible. I think it might be possible. Maybe. Hopefully. It would be nice to have these creatures be able to visualize them again though i don't think possible in our timelines but hopefully for our future generations it will be i mean science and technology will only evolve it's it can't be stopped there is no no stopping the progression of technology oh no the more it advances the faster it advances mm, yes no stopping it indeed it's a good thing of course Though, unfortunately, reactionaries think it's a bad thing. Obviously, because they're reactionaries. Hmm. 
I wonder why, though. Why would people want to stop the advancement of our species? That is rather... Hmm, I don't know. I can't comprehend that thought. I suppose it's just a different way of thinking. Different way of thinking, indeed. Now, I believe this is nearly over. This is what I've done in one hour. Not bad. Hopefully this level will be completed soon. Um, and then there's going to be other levels, I'm assuming. Or maybe not. Maybe I'll stay on this level. I'm not too sure. No, no, no. Not too sure, indeed. Though I know ways to how to improve a lot of these. Especially the borders here with the cages. Oh, no. What's happened here? Someone has contracted COVID. Uh, which pool needs it? Oh, I need to assign them to this. Very well. Assign these. Oh, no. The COVID's spreading. <laughs> this is not good. <laughs> look, you fool. You spread it to all your fellows. Oh, look at this. Yeah, this is weird. Yeah, this is very weird. I didn't even know they were this big. Oh, yeah, it's definitely like giant ostriches. Everything was much bigger back in the day. Trees, plants, organisms, literally everything. It just got smaller. I'm, I'm assuming things got smaller because the small things survived the whatever killed the dinosaurs, which was assuming meteor, a meteorite. Quite a big one, especially since the continents were all together. They weren't separated. Oceans dividing them. Thus, the meteor got to all the world, the whole world, the whole globe. Uh, yeah, these things are getting contracted with diseases as well. You know, I really hope it's not anything severe like rabies. Oh, it tells me right here. What is this? Turbo, turbo colossus, colossus, turbo colossus, um, is an infectious disease that can be spread to the air and through direct contact. Can be fatal unless cured with darts. Well, that's not good. I should, gotta cure this immediately then. Um, very well then. We shall cure these fools. Can I cure them with this? No, I cannot. Yeah, let me pause it. Kong is disgruntled. You're disgruntled, are you? Go take a nap. Rest. You too. Rats. Incubate and release the following dinosaur. Dimetrodon or whatever it's called. Right here. Alright, I can I can literally. Very cool. Sorry, is this not enough? Yeah, I'm no fool. There. I'll do one. H how much is it? <clears throat> Six! That's good enough. Which one should they go in? Since they're meat eaters, they should probably go in a bigger one, maybe? I don't know. I'll see. I'll see. I shall see. I shall see. We shall see. I shall see. The time will come. Uh... Where is it? Where is the hospital? Oh, right here. No. Wait. Fool. What are you doing? Is he stuck? He, he got stuck right here. Ah. The game's code sometimes concerns me. These things are... They're dying. They're literally dying. And this thing was just sitting there. Like I said, these things have pure incompetence sometimes. Wait, what's the point of the gate if they can just go drive through it? Which is, uh, if I may say, really cool. Fool, where are you going? Oh, I see. Well, I guess I'll save this for later. Yes, not bad so far, not bad.